Well, hello there, folks. This is the Kraken right back again. I just made a video about the uh, Deep Seeks Janus 7B Pro. A little quick, I think about a nine minute video. You know, I started thinking about it. I wanted to check to see if Olama actually had the model up and they do. So I want to talk about that really quick. And it's, it's actually a positive experience instead of a negative one. So let's, um, let's look into that real quick. And I'm going to pull this up and it's going to be blindingly white because Olama's webpage is that way. I want to start with kind of a dark screen here, but like be prepared, it's coming. There it is. Okay, so we're here. So if you don't have a Llama, you probably should. It's a, it's a locally installed large language model server sort of thing. So down here in my taskbar, you can see I don't have anything right now. I got OBS, I got Bluetooth stuff, my NVIDIA drivers, uh, the stuff from my motherboard and Discord is currently running, that's it. Download and install this and what you'll get is your Llama. Now, if you go up here to the top, you'll see models. And then, because the, this is the newest one, everyone's talking about it, you can click on DeepSeek R1. And here's a little drop down that shows you all the different sizes. Now, check this out 404 gigabytes, 43 gigabytes, 20 gigabytes, 9, 5, we'll round up. 5, we're still rounding up, but this is the 7B. And then you have the 1.5B. And the B stands for billion whatevers. I don't know. Whatever they are. You know what I mean. Well, anyways, to install, all you got to do is select the one you want. I think the 7B is the one that everyone's talking about right now. So we're going to come over here. Deep Seek R1 7B. We're going to hit the little double thing right here. You see this? Now, that's all we need. Once you have a llama installed. Okay. So now I can go to command prompt. So I'm gonna come down here and just type in CMD, open up a command prompt, and I'm going to hit control V to paste that in and just hit enter. And what it's going to do right now is it's going to download and then start Olama with this. Now you can communicate with your large language model through this chat window, through the command prompt window. You can just type right into it. But what we're gonna be doing <clears throat> excuse me, is, I don't know if you have it or not, but Pinocchio. Pinocchio is this front end thing that allows you to install a whole bunch of different things. Yeah, see, send message right there. So I can talk to Alama right now. I'm gonna close this window though, and we are going to open up Pinocchio. With Pinocchio installed, and you know what, it should have an update, but you can see the Alama chatbot right there. So I'm gonna use that one. And now you have this and it says, you know, make sure you have Olama running. So we look down here, we can see the little llama. And then here we have this and we can choose the model we want. So I'm going to do the deep seek. Let's test it out. There it is. Hello. How can I assist you today? What is the air speed velocity? of the of a unladen swallow ah oh, they said the movie up where the pigeons are carrying mail A European swallow might be different. So it's not referencing Monty Python. Going forward, talk like a pirate. Since I'm in that. What are the ingredients in diet seven up? Okay. Seven up is a soft drink made by so it's still doing some Chinese. Carbonated water, sugar, flavoring agents, and artificial sweeteners and colors. Okay, so I said diet 7-Up and didn't know, doesn't know the difference. So let's compare that real quick with um, ChatGPT. There's the 01. Oh, 01 now works with Canvas. Okay, cool. What? are the ingredients of diet 
seven up. All right, so obviously not gonna return that fast. Also, ChatGPT Online has access to the interwebs, so we can look things up. There you go. So having it locally installed on your hard drive is not necessarily going to give you up-to-date information. It's not gonna allow it to go out onto the internet and do some searching. That is just the way it is. But for general purposes, I'm sure you could. Can you help me write some Python code? So maybe it can. Write me some code to look at an image and describe what it is. Install Llama, install Pinocchio, and you can download you know, first, I showed you how to download the model. Then you can play around with it at, ho at home, locally on your computer. Have a great time. And I trust it. I think it's safe to do that way because you're not really connected to the internet through there and it's not downloading more code. It's Pinocchio. And Pinocchio you can trust. And Alama you can trust. And with that, I'm out of here. You guys all have a great week. Weekend. January's almost over. Going into February. Remember, we got Valentine's Day coming, and I will see you on the next video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you know when I, I release the next video. And uh, with that, I'm going to get out of here and go back to work on my projects here. I'm still working on my big one to come out. So it's, it's coming this week for sure. It's coming. See you guys later.